Hello everyone and welcome back to another Doctor Who unboxing. Yes, today we're unboxing a very exciting package. One of my favourite packages to get and that is of course the Doctor Who collection lineup. This is a good day because we get season 22 and the Peter Cushing, well the first film Doctor Who and the Daleks on 4K uh, being released on the 20th of June. So this is a good day to be a Doctor Who fan. So the way this is going to work is I'm going to unbox it, show the presentation of the box set then we're going to talk about the new special features what will feature exclusively on this Blu-ray set. And then I'll do the collection Blu-ray lineup and then close off this video. So that's the way this video is going to work. So without further ado, let's begin the unboxing. Okay, on to the unboxing now. It feels like an absolute eternity since this was announced. I think this was announced back in January. So we've been waiting six months and it feels so good to finally have another collection box set uh, joining the lineup because, you know, they're great things to have. So we've just... Open up like so. There we go. You got the lovely spine there of Mr. Colin Baker looking very colourful in his colourful glory. So, bam, there it is. Season 22 on Blu ray. And my goodness, it's real. It actually exists. Um, yeah, so we're going to take off the cellophane and then we'll have a closer look at the artwork. Um, but yeah, this is very exciting. I'm, I'm loving the look of this already. I mean, Lee Binding really has knocked this out of the park. So, let's take off the cellophane prison and then we can dive in to the actual artwork and have a closer look at it. Huzzah! The cellophane prison has been removed, so let's take a closer look at this artwork. So I have to say, Lee Binding has knocked out the park once again. I think that this is a real stunning piece of artwork. So we've got the lovely sort of starfield background, very reminiscent of the one what we see in sort of the uh, re-edit of Terror of the Vervoids on season 23. Uh, we've got the Sixth Doctor holding that sort of device from Attack of the Cybermen. I can't, it's been a while since I've watched um, these stories because I've been saving myself for this box set. Um, so let's take a look at the lovely monsters there. So we've got the lovely glass Dalek, the Borad, very iconic, can't wait to see the updated special effects for Time Lash. Uh, then we have, of course, the Cyber Leader. It's rather excellent. That's a Tom Baker Cyber Leader. Um, not very good. Um, so yeah, we've got the Master there, and then the Rani, and then we've got, I think that's Stike, and then we have Silver. Um, then we have Doctor Who Collection Season 22. And the spine of the release, of course, we'll do a lineup showing you all the lovely uh, collection box sets so far. So, this set includes Continue Your Doctor Who Archive of the Ultimate Collector's set with Attack of the Simon, Vengeance on Varos, The Mark of the Rani, which was filmed literally down the road from me. I've done a location video uh, revisiting the Mark of the Rani location. I'll leave a link in the description below to that video so you can check it out. Um, a cheeky little plug there. Um, and that's one thing I'm really excited about, actually. Uh, the location location uh, feature within this for two doctors time lash and revelation of the daleks all 13 episodes newly restored for blu-ray and packed with brand new extra material which is very exciting so we've got some of the extras there which is all very cool so if we take off the j card i'm very excited to see what's the back of this release actually because there's always a lovely little fun little easter egg oh <laughs> that is very cool and um, we've got this sort of tardis disguised this sort of the the organ, I think, from Attack of the Cybermen, which is really great. I love that sort of nice Cosmos star fill background. We've got the clean artwork there, which you can really admire the beauty of it. So let's open this set up. This is all we can like to see what it's like inside. So we've got this lovely booklet tray done like Revelation of the Daleks. I really like that. That is a nice piece of artwork. Then we have the disc. So if we take a look at the disc, so disc one is Attack of the Cybermen. Now, I will be honest, the disc for this set i will be honest the blu-ray sets have been a little bit lacking in sort of the disc art compartment i think it's a bit interesting having the cyberman side on um but yeah I, I, it's okay disc two a vengeance on varus very nice sort of simple disc i would say and then disc three i believe is vengeance on varus again with the governor and sill i should have altered this round before uh, filming but hey we're rolling with it so what's disc four disc four is of course a mark of the rani um, very excited to give this one a go because it's my favourite Colin Baker story. Uh, maybe because it was filmed locally, so I'm a little bit biased. So we've got the Two Doctors Disc 5, uh, and then we have the Two Doctors Disc 6, which, yeah, I think that's a cool lot of disc. I think it would have been more fitting to swap the other discs around, so this be artwork for Disc 5, and then Disc 6 is, of course, the Sixth Doctor, but I really like that nice little touch, nice little mirroring there. And then, of course, Disc 7 is the Time Lash, um, yeah, very interesting story. I don't mind it, I don't hate it, it's just kind of there. And then we have a revelation of the Daleks, and if we remove disc 8, we have the lovely Colin Baker looking very cheerful 
um, bless him, good old Colin. So if we take a look at the actual booklet tray now, so like I say, a lovely revelation of the Daleks artwork. Um, we've got even a Dalek in the background, I've just noticed. That's a really nice little attention to detail. And that's a nice little nod. I quite like that little Easter egg. So if we open it up, we have some Two Doctors style artwork there from the ship in part one with the Sontarans attacking. Very nice action-packed artwork. I really do like that. I guess we'll see the artwork uh, in a minute and proper because I think that's a booklet. So what we've got here, we've got some lovely promotional stuff. So let's, let's have a quick little gander. So we've got the Sip Doctor BBC Audios, Time Fractures, that's aged poorly because that's shut down now, which is rather sad, a bit of sad that I didn't get to go and see it. Then we have the Enamel Pin Badges Collection, very cool. Save the Universe, the Doctor Escape Room, um, the Doctor Who Companion set, so that's a nice little bit of marketing for the Season 22 Doctor Who figurine stuff. Doctor Who Magazine, of course. Any big finish? Of course, yes we do. We have Mind of the Hodiac, the Terrence Dix Essential Collection, and we have the Pirate Planet on vinyl and the new Doctor Who exhibition what's opened in Liverpool. So nice little bit of promo stuff and of course comics. But the booklet, let's look at the booklet. That's the main exciting thing about this. So if we take it out, we get to see the lovely clean artwork there of the booklet itself. But let's have a quick look at the TARDIS console, see if there's any Easter eggs there. And there is, we've got the comet there and we've got a stealth Cyberman entering the TARDIS. Very, very cool. We've got the sick doctor fixing one of the roundels there. Um, yeah, very nice little thing. So, back to the booklet. You can see I'm just very excited. I'm all over the place with it. So there we go, got the lovely artwork there. Very sort of new series style. I really uh, do like that. So let's open it up and have a little look. So, change, my dear. Welcome to season 22. Got Colin looking rather confused. Um, bless him. Good old Colin. We like Colin here. So, disc one is Attack of the Cybermen. I will do a rundown of the new special features once we've had a quick look at the booklet. So there we go, it tells you all the contents of the production side of it and the reception and development of the story. All very nice detailed stuff, lovely artwork for Attack of the Cybermen there with Colin attacking the Cyber Leader uh, production there. And of course, what else have we got here? We've got the after image, how the story was uh, received. Vengeance on Varus again, we've got a nice little content page of the story. And then of course we've got a bit of bit of artwork there and the extended episodes for this one which is going to be quite interesting to watch and a bit more bio on the actual story and the reception and the after image of the actual story itself and then we have the mark of the Rani again showing the content on each disc and the reception and the development of the story nice bit of artwork there which is all very cool and again disc, uh, disc 5 and 6 we have the two doctors um, again showing what's each content on there and again, talking about the development, and we've got a nice little image there of the two doctors. What else have we got here? So we've got a nice bit of, pretty nice bit of chunky bit of bio on the two doctors, which is always good. Um, yeah, very nice. And then we have the time lash. Um, yeah, very, very interesting android. Um, and all the time, <laughs> time lash gets a, a nice big piece of artwork. That's rather interesting. Um, yeah, quite cool actually. It does make time lash look a rather cool story, doesn't it? When you look at that. And then, of course, we have a revelation of the Daleks. Quite a, quite a bleak story. And got some nice bit of artwork there for the story itself. And again, the usual reception development and after image of the story. And then we've got a nice picture of Davros. And on the back there, we've got a smiley Colin Baker. So let's take a look at the actual content, which is on each disc. So taking a look at the new special features, what features on the Season 22 Blu-ray box set. So on disc one, Attack of the Cybermen. We have Behind the Sofa with Colin Baker, Nicola Bryant, Terry Malloy, Peter Davison, Janet Fielding, Sarah Sutton, Sylvester McCoy and Wendy Pampery. So that's quite an interesting combo. Peter Davison I'm very excited about and Janet Fielding is always sort of the highlight on the Behind the Sofa. So that's very exciting. So we have In Conversation with Colin Baker with Matthew Sweet. Matthew Sweet interviews Colin Baker. These are always a nice little detailed interview. Um, and Matthew Sweet always brings out the best in the, in the interviewee. So I always look forward to those. Uh, we have the Saturday Superstore excerpt with Colin Baker, Nicola Bryant and Mary Tam and Jacqueline Pierce. Breakfast time excerpt about Attack of the Cybermen previewing that. We have the optional enhanced 5.1 audio trails and continuity, revised and updated production subtitles and photo gallery in HD. Now those are on all existing discs. Disc 2 in terms of new special features on the Vengeance on Varos we have Behind the Sofa. See here excerpt with Nabil Shaban. The audio interview with the director and then disc free for vengeance on varus is the two extended episodes restored in hd so we have the new special features which is the michael grade in conversation with matthew sweet slip back a complete six-part doctor radio adventure 
studio footage and the PDF material for Slipback and the Colin Baker Years VHS cover, if that takes your fancy. And then disc four, the Mark of the Rani. Again, we have all the existing special features, what are on the DVDs, but this is just covering the new content. So in terms of new content for the Mark of the Rani, we have behind the sofa for Mark of the Rani, location, location, which is my most anticipated one where we see um, Nicola Bryan to Colin Baker go all over the season 22 um, locations, which is gonna be a very cool alternative music score. The breakfast time excerpt, and of course, trails and continuity and revised and updated production subtitles and photo gallery. And then at disc five for the two doctors, so we have the three episodes restored in HD, and we have behind the sofa, La Fiesta de Mal, which I think is the making off of the two doctors, so that's gonna be very exciting. A fix of the Sontarans recut, and a point of view excerpt. And we even have a commentary on a fix of Sontarans, which is kind of interesting. And we have the news report on the Doctor Hiatus, a message from the Doctor Appreciation Society from Fraser Hines and Nicola Bryant. And then of course we have the usual Trails and Continuity production subtitles and photo gallery in HD and of course PDF material. So disc 7, the time lash. Um, so we have new sort of updated effects for it. This is the story what's been picked for that. We have behind the sofa, Nicola Bryant in conversation, which I think would have made more sense to be on season 21 since that's her introduction, but I guess this is just to pad out of a box it with even more new features, which, hey, I'm not complaining because, you know, I love me some special features. And then we have the updated um, visual effects shots, studio footage, trails and continuity and revised and updated production subtitles. Now, disc eight is where you're gonna get your main bulk of updated special features. So we're behind the sofa on Revelation of the Daleks, audio commentary with Colin Baker, Nicola Bryant, Terry Malloy and Alexi Sale. Extended part one, optional updated visual effects, studio footage, mute film rushes, a breakfast time excerpt covering Revelation of the Daleks and the Doctor exhibition, and then we have an Eleanor Braun interview and a John Nathan Turner interview, take two excerpt broadcast, micro live excerpt of Colin Baker in costume, the eternal mystery of the collection Blu-ray box set trailer for this series, which I really liked, it was a nice little trailer. And then we have the Trails and Continuity and Revised and Updated Production Subtitles and Photo Gallery in HD. So those are your new special features. What feature on Season 22? So let's do a collection of Blu-ray lineup. how the collection series is looking on the shelf. Okay, so Season 22 is added to the shelf and yeah, it's looking good, isn't it? It's looking very good to see all these Blu-ray box sets. So this is always one of the stunning things about getting these box sets to seeing how it all lines up. And yeah, it's looking good and it's it's crazy to think we've almost completed Colin Baker. We just need one more story and then we have the whole Colin Baker era on Blu-ray, which is kind of sad, but you know, we've got to face it eventually. Um, yeah, it'd be nice to add some Blu-rays from the 60s. I think season two is going to be coming out next, which I'm very excited about because, you know, it'd be nice to add a Hartnell set to the collection lineup. I think season eight is still my favourite artwork, but I have to say I really do like the season 22 artwork. So let's close off this video. There we have it, that has been my unboxing of Doctor Who The Collection Season 22. So I'm off to watch Location Location and just chow down on all the new features and re-watch this series because that's always the joy about this collection series is that even if it's a season you're not too fond of, it's a chance to reappraise and reevaluate this season and I think it's time for Season 22 to get that reevaluation and reappraisal. So I'm off to begin the Season 22 marathon with Attack of the Cybermen and of course, chow into the new special feature as well. So yes, thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you've enjoyed this video, then please do like and subscribe for plenty more Doctor related content coming up in the near future. And I'll see you very soon. So thank you very much and change my dear. And it seems not a moment too soon. Goodbye everyone.